welcome to Shannon's Cooking Show. For those of you who don't know me, that's ridiculous. I'm famous on Snapchat. Now today I'm going to be showing you how to make the best vegan acai bowl you've ever made in your whole life. And it's really easy. You just need three simple ingredients. Fruit, a blender, toppings, acai, and a bowl. As you can see, I have absolutely shit all to make an acai bowl. But something that's really close to an acai bowl is spaghetti. And we're going to be making a gluten-free spaghetti because that's the same as vegan. And obviously I care about the environment. And if you're not vegan, you clearly hate yourself and the entire world. I've just prepared these ingredients previously. You can just get them out of your own backyard. I grow all of mine in a veggie patch. What the fuck is this? I want this. So the first thing you're going to need is the gluten-free spaghetti. It says coals, but that's actually just the name of my veggie patch. This one is kale. This is a tomato. Obviously, this glad wrap isn't real plastic because that's not sustainable for the earth. This is zucchini. Capsicum. Broccoli. I think this is garlic. Garlic, right? It's garlic. Mm. And Blackboard Coffee. This wasn't sponsored by Blackboard Coffee. However, if you do enjoy your coffee, Blackboard is the coffee for you. <laughs> Oven sauce. Obviously, you need this. You can create your own sauce, which is already what I've done. Uh, so if you see this in supermarkets, it's my own sauce. You probably know me. My last name is, in fact, Barilla. Not to be confused with Gorilla, am I right? <laughs> Too soon. Cooked anything before. I'm putting some water in it. No, I'm sorry, I probably should have boiled it. I don't know how much water I need. This is slow fucking tap. Okay, great. So while we're waiting for that to boil, we'll just get these ready. We will cut the vegetables. This is a capsicum, obviously, and you just want to cut that down the middle. This is actually the healthiest part. Um, this is where the seeds are. A better lifestyle for everyone. I love cooking. Cooking's what I love. I wrote that song myself. Just then. Okay, I'm done with this. Next, and just cut it vigorously. Now, obviously, if you don't have any of these ingredients, just don't eat, actually, because these ingredients are essential to a sustainable lifestyle. Thank you. And we have tomato, which looks a lot like capsicum, so if you only have one of them, you can just substitute it for another. Yeah. So, fun fact, no one actually likes broccoli because it's disgusting. If you don't have a broccoli, just go out to your backyard, find the smallest tree, and cut it down. I like to cut my broccoli into tiny little pieces and then you can't taste it. Our next ingredient is kale. Mm. But Beyonce likes kale. The full on Beyonce, am I right? Some people ask me if you don't have kale, can you just use spinach? It's fucking ridiculous. Of course you can. But Beyonce doesn't like spinach. Beyonce's actually vegan, did you know that I'm a vegan? I love the environment, I love animals, save the world. I'm sweating. <laughs> Do you see that? Zoom in. I'm not ashamed. Why have I been kale and pasta? Why the fuck not, Tash? Well, because Beyonce eats kale. It's really easy to substitute garlic if you don't know how to crush it properly. I obviously do. The average citizen has no fucking idea. So, minced garlic. Mmm. <laughs> <laughs> now we just wait for the pasta to boil. So now that it's boiled, I just like to put a little salt in there. If you don't, it's insulting. <laughs> Alright, I'll add the pasta. You just hold it there for a little bit and just drop it. You break the pasta, that's fine. Makes it easier to eat afterwards, am I right, Italians? Haha, <laughs> yeah. I speak Italian. Vettuccini. A gelato. I really forgot about the sauce until this moment. I forgot that it doesn't actually cook itself. I don't mind to use spoons, so I think that's ridiculous. So you're just gonna pour it in. Perfect, <laughs> alright! So now that I can smell the garlic. Um, oh, that was fucking hot! <laughs> Want, but then you wouldn't be the greatest chef in the world like I am. <laughs> I am my own show. This is it. I don't know if you knew this, but red actually symbolizes love and green symbolizes the environment because I love the environment. Go vegan. We're gonna cook the kale. So you that a little bit. Tomato. So fucking tiring. The thoughts that I've already pre made. Now show up. I work out. That's the spot. Seasoning? Tis the season to be jolly, am I right? <laughs> You're gonna need 
chili flakes. If you don't like chili, get the fuck out, okay? That's racist. Italian herbs, because pasta is an Italian dish, you know, I'm obviously Italian. And now just some pepper. Smells like chili. <laughs> so now that it's cooked, put that on the side and wait for the pasta to finish cooking. <laughs> Fun facts about pasta. It's Italian. <laughs> We're going to plate it up or bowl it up. Be careful with the boiling water, it's boiling, it's really hot. Put that up, obviously I'm not going to eat all of it. Perfect. We just get a handful of that very carefully. Now for a taste test. Do you want it? No. Have we made a mess? Shannon's cooking show. Send me photos of your acai bowls. <laughs>